Hi everyone, Larry Satchwell here. Back in May, I think it was, we first started experimenting with these fly exterminators and they really do the trick. We look excited. They just came yesterday. Right on top, it says, if you have issues with this, give them a call. We need to go put these down at the barn. So they provide these bags. A friend of ours down the road, she just throws hers out in the stalls but I prefer to put it in this bag. Yes, Duke. And we just divided it in half. You have to put these up pretty shortly after you receive them because those little guys hatch. And I'm hoping we have enough flies left that they'll be eating something. All right, this is the fourth time we've replaced these this summer. And the first couple of times I just put a staple up here because I didn't know if we were going to be using it. But I love these things, so I'm going to put a, a nail up here. And I could just... I could just sprinkle this in the stall. But this up here, the horses don't mess with it. And I think it's just a better way to do it. I'll put one up over there, and then one in the chicken coop. So as I stand here and watch these guys eat, there's just no flies around, and that is so different than years past. So we will definitely be using fly exterminator. Same thing in the chicken coop. As you can see from this old fly strip from last year, flies are a problem in the chicken coop too, but this year they're just not that much of a problem. So I'm Two thumbs up and five stars for fly exterminators from good nature guys. Thanks for watching.